got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Ugh. Chloe! Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me, too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna sorry, be Warren. Sorry, Warren. to Rachel. Let's go. Now. Chloe, wait! Listen! I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once! Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit! Nathan is the fucking serial killer! We saw the proof! Now excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Jefferson kidnapped Rachel and some other girls. He was also manipulating Nathan, and he killed him. Then it's Jefferson's turn to die now. I understand why you don't want to do this, and I won't blame you for not coming with me. Chloe! If I'm totally strong and honest, she'll listen. I'm her best friend. Excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never... Nathan is dead, and you're in that fucker is because I was there. Mark Jefferson turned out to be a psychopath. Okay, Max, let's go in there as a team and take his ass out right now. Chloe, I know this isn't easy, but it's time for you and me to let the past go. We have to focus on our future while we still have one. That's so easy for you to say. You don't know what my life has been these past five years. Come on, of course I... But at some point you have to move forward. One thing I learned at Blackwell is the saying, those who don't learn from history are doomed to repeat it. I have to do this. So I guess I'm on my own. Again. You almost had her, Max. I can still do this. Nathan, that fucker. Because, will you please? Mark Jefferson turned out to be a psych. Okay, Max. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm... I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson with one bullet. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. 
and it, you, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you, you asked me to end your life. I did. For you, I, I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's... That's why you should come with me, so we can stay together. And stay alive. I hear you, Max, but... Do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us, and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's not even at our house anymore. Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked. It actually worked. You're with me again. It looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And I traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it. I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. I'm nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I always wanted my life to be special. An adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out. We were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. 
for once I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look! The storm is getting bigger now, and it's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real! This is happening because of me! Stop it! Is this, stop beating yourself up, okay? We've both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on! Chloe... I've got your back, Rex. Whoa! Alfred Hitchcock famously called film Little Pieces of Time. I I'm back in class. As he what the hell? House. These pieces of time can frame us in our glory. And I have our to sorrow. listen to this Jefferson Light lecture again. This <sighs> might be hell. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly... Okay, this is messed up. In black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm and don't freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces. I feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as torture. What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Everybody's gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Too creepy. You didn't die, Kate. You're alive. Not yet, you bastard. Holy shit. Look at all these dead birds. This can't be real. Rachel didn't deserve any of this. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. No way. My selfies are shit. I need to be framed by a real artist. I'm just a poser. Yes. You will be posing. For me. There's so many angles I want to expose you with to the world. I hope you don't mind needles or duct tape. This can't be real. I don't believe it.
Kate? Max, why did you stop me from jumping? What kind of friend are you? You never understood me, or what happened to me. Now my family will never leave me alone, and that means I'll always be alone. Thanks to you. Kate, that's not true. I've always been your friend. Rachel Amber, she was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. So Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there for you. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia without a word, without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck were you wearing my bracelet? Calm yourself, right? Everything's yet. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smart ass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I miss Rachel, too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said after the battle. Sounds like you totally crushed on Rachel. You would have, too. Smart, sexy, and sassy. Like me, right? Well, duh. <laughs> Maybe Rachel would have thought it was both of us. Because she looks beautiful in them, you look like ass. Even a gun doesn't make you any sexy. I wonder if Rachel has a room around here. She's jealous of Rachel. It's just the two of us, nobody else. I'm not scared at all. You have the power. This close to finding Rachel. We have to find our masks. Jesus, she was banging that pig, right? There's a little bit of an ordinary scheme in the sea of family rope shops. I'm here for having my master series, you know. 
guys, the letter is what he wants to do. something wrong. Don't try to hide, Max! Get over here! Let me capture you! Jefferson is coming after Max. me again. You no. used to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die. Please understand, Max. The only place I can be my selfie is in the dark room. What happened to your spark, Max? I thought I could be Maybe your Maybe I'll be safe in the lighthouse. Maybe I'll wake up. I realize now you'll never be an artist. Much oh, Max! Max. 
Max, where are you? Max, come out to play. Come out to play. Hey, babe, babe. Who wants to go, Abe? Go away, go away, baby! I found out who went through my files. You dig my wheels, Max? Get in the car! I'll take you for a ride. Get in the car! If only Kate Marsh would have jumped off that roof. Could blame Miss Kaufman. She would finally get her kicked out here. of Blackwell. You can run, She's but a you bad can't influence. hide from your white knight. Over here, young Max. Give it up! You're my spirit animal. How can I tell Max's parents? What's that she's up with you and that blue haired loser? Damn it, Max! Wake up! I knew I should have given that scholarship to Victoria instead of Max. Miss Price can't just show up at Blackwell in a wheelchair and think we're going to accommodate her every whip. You can't escape my surveillance, Missy! Admit it, Max. Hey, Missy! Admit it, Max. You're just jealous because me and Victoria actually... Bony ass over here. I'm gonna cut you open, freak. Those were my beans, Max. Max. Those were my Max. fucking beans. I want to share my gift with you. Don't you dare run away. Oh, no. Bottles. This might be hell. Max! 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 Come back in the dark room. I know you're dying for it. Max! Nobody ever helped me, Max. Especially you. Don't you dare run Rachel away. Rachel Amber. Just like her last name. Well, these ones aren't too hard to find. And feel that cold. Run. Max, sit down. You're taking a time out, no matter what. This is my nightmare. Let me have one sanctuary. Of course, this is where Chloe and Rachel used to hide from the world. But I can't hide for long. Whatever reality I'm in feels like a bad dream. Am I just not learning my lesson? Maybe your real lesson is to get out of this place. Just don't be afraid, Max. Let them be afraid of you. It's time for you to die too, skank. Max, you need to get high okay, like Rachel. Rachel. Look just like a Want zombie drugs? model in the dirt. Just bone, meat, and maggots. Oh, I would be all over that shit. Oh, when did I get bad bottle karma? Psst. Max. Me and Rachel are floating Is down Is there one more left? The Come on down. Stop! Come on. Holy fucking shit, Max. That was hilarious when you guys dug up Rachel's body. <laughs> oh, oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, oh. oh Rachel, it's horrible. My blood spattered angel.
Please let that be the last one. Great headshots. Especially you. It's gonna be so I need proof that bottles were out to get me, just in case. Want some drugs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am, when your mom's away. I'll let her know that. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two wins. What? get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us you to You are ridiculous. Upon. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar! You're bankrupting me! Aha! You can't hide from me forever! Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Will this nightmare go on? I think you'd be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Max is a fucking child. Oh Christ, I know. And she never shuts up, does she? I'm so over her hipster bullshit. I think everyone at Blackwell is over Max. Let's prove it. Booyah, Warren. I thought you were all over Max's shit. Not after she kissed me. Her breath was ass, no tongue. I hear that. I'm not into nerds, but you're pretty cute. I'm not into Max anyway. So let's bust a move. God damn, you are a sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. I hear that. Do you want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. Oh shit, look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch. Or take a selfie. See, this is how you bust a move, Max. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Damn, Victoria. You're a real woman. Not a little girl like Max. I fucking love your tats, Chloe. You're so hot. I can't believe it took us so long to hook up. Why did you get rewind powers? You don't even know how to use them. Rachel's dead and you're still alive. Life is so not fair. I wish you would have never come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm.
I'll be so grateful if this is the last digicode. Great, numbers are all over the place. How will I find the right code? Don't kill us, Max! I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. Shit, Max. I thought we were on the same team. Now I'll die alone. Max, I hope you do the right thing. I can't believe I you kissed me.